Just heading out on a recreational shoot tonight. A good friend of mine is going to come out and we're going to chase some foxes. You gotta love big boys toys. So you can see I've got the 223 suppressed. I'm a professional shooter in New South Wales and have suppressor permits. Uh, it makes it an absolute joy to shoot. On top of it, I'm running the Pulsar Trail 2 XP50 LRF thermal rifle scope. And the second rifle, which my mate will be using tonight, is my 17 HMR. Little CZ455, Cogswell and Harrison. On top of it, we've got the prototype Hick Micro Panther. Uh, it's another 640 resolution scope with the LRF on it. I'm doing some testing on it at the moment. I'll make comment on that further down the track when I've had some more time with it. Obviously there's two of us, so we need to run two handhelds. I'll be using my Pulsar Helion 2 Pro XP50. And the other one is actually a thermal rifle scope. <laughs> Little test unit I've got from Hick Micro. It's a TQ50 Thunder. But you can see how tiny it is in my hand. It also doubles for a really good little handheld monocular. There's been plenty of foxes around of late and I haven't been out to this property for a while. So hopefully we get to smash a few. And yeah, it's always good hanging with mates. He's chasing the birds. <laughs> Bloody cat. Cats are off the menu. That sucks. Little fox pup just beside that dam. I do like this colour palette though. These those plumpers give away the foxes, don't they? <laughs> Good shot. Does that hit hard? I swear these cats are just tormenting me. Farmer's got several of them. Go on, piss off. Psst. Hey. Good day. There's one in the shoot, dude. <laughs> it's a better one. Second one was good. First one was high. These three quarter grown pups have been playing around the house for about half an hour now, chasing insects, having a great time. So hard to get their attention. You just be patient, and I'm sure sooner or later they'll work their way down and give us a safe shot.
Looks like you got him through the left ear. He's shaking it off. Good shot. <laughs> it's a fop. Well, we had a bloody good night on the foxes. Uh, we ended up with eight. Uh, these six pups were up around the house, as you probably saw in the earlier video, video footage. In the video. <laughs> Start again. Well, we had a bloody good night on the foxes tonight. Ended up with eight all told. My mate Ian got six up at... <sighs> all the time. Well, we had a bloody good night on the foxes tonight. Ended up with eight in total. Six pups of varying ages. I'd say they're from two different litters. 17 HMR was very effective. That's all we used this evening. The problem we had was they were all up around the house and very difficult to find a safe shooting angle. We ended up just having to be patient and um, eventually, one by one, they sort of got into the right spot. And Ian managed to uh, Knock six down, which was great. And uh, after collecting them, we came back down to the car, which is about 300 metres further down the driveway. And I'll be buggered, but there were the two foxes that uh, were hanging around down here. Uh, they were both adults. So a bit of a mixed bag, six pups, two adults. Uh, great to get them out of the system. And uh, I'm sure the farmer will be very happy. Anyhow, fun night for us. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to the channel and I'll catch up with you guys next time.